what's going on everyone welcome back to my channel this is your girl lady tarot t i am back with another reading let's see what's going on with capricorn sun moon and rising male and female take what resonates leave the rest don't forget to like this video, Ooh. <laughs> share this video, subscribe to my YouTube channel, click that bell notification button so you can always be notified whenever I upload a reading. Alright, let's get into it, Spirit of the Universe, Holy Spirit, Angels of the White Divine Light, please give me clear messages for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, male and female, please and thank you. So let's grab a few more messages here from my deck, okay, hmm. Okay, a few more. We got some that's like stuck at the bottom. Um, I'm going to grab those in a second. Um, oh, all right. Let's stop there. Um, bottom of the deck, we got Facebook. So social media could be significant for some of y'all or Facebook could be significant for some of y'all. All right. Somebody could be watching you on social media. Doesn't necessarily have to be Facebook, but... Those are one of the social sites that this person may be watching you on, okay? Um, I'm trying to trap you with the baby so I can forever have access to you. So somebody wants to trap you. Um, I follow and watch everything you do. Interesting. No wonder why we got Facebook at the bottom of the deck, okay? So um, if not Facebook, then this person follows you on social media, whether it be Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, TikTok, um, whatever social sites, <laughs> this person may be watching you, following you, possibly from a fake account as well. But this person is trying to trap you, okay? Or they would like to trap you. This person feels like uh, you don't want them no more. So it may be a situation where you're no longer communicating with this person. Um, however, they are talking to you. About talking to you. Maybe they want to talk to you. They're talking to their friends and their family about you. They won't shut up. Okay, so I talk to my family and friends about you all the time. I won't shut up. Okay, and um, wow, look at this shit. I want to see if I can use you. What can you provide? So, be careful with this energy here. Um, for some of you, this person wants to use you. So, you may have a lot. I, f um, I feel like maybe this person is an, uh, is an opportunist. Okay? Can't talk. So, this person doesn't want this message to get out. Um, I feel like this person is an opportunist. Okay? Um, they see that you have, that they can gain a lot from you. Thank you, spirit. That's the energy that I'm picking up. Okay? So, just be careful. Um, again, you're no longer in communication with this person. You may have cut them off or walked away from them. Um, and this person has no choice but to watch you at a distance, okay? Watch you from afar um, is the energy that I'm picking up. But they are talking about you. They're gossiping about you to their friends, to their family, to anyone who would listen is the energy that I'm picking up, okay? Thank you, Spirit. So, let's see. Be careful that this person may if they if they can if they get a chance they will try to trap you okay uh, we got dolphin financial gain usually coming from something you did in the past so it's something about your money okay maybe you're working really hard okay and it's paying off for you when it comes to your finances um, you're very abundant okay if you're working, you may have worked really hard in the past and now all of that is paying off, okay? This person sees that. Again, they're watching you on social media. They're seeing everything that you post. They're seeing everything that you do. So you need to really, you know, be aware of that. Let's grab some more messages for Capricorn, please, and thank you. Let's grab some more messages um we have boots increase your efforts if you want to achieve your goals so i feel like you've been again you've been putting in a lot of hard work um you're achieving some sort of goal okay um you are abundant and again this person sees it what other messages spirit do you have okay for um okay we got fair man, dealings or relationship with a man with blonde, gray, or white hair. Doesn't necessarily have to be that color hair. 
but this is nonetheless a masculine energy. Okay, we got staff. You will be taken care of in difficult times. So I feel like this is my spirit got your back card, okay? So whatever obstacles that may come your way, I feel like you will be taken care of, okay? I feel like spirit definitely has your back. But this masculine energy is trying to put toward the effort to achieve their goal. I feel like their goal is to trap you for some reason or to have some sort of access to you, to gain access to you. Because um, again, for a lot of... For a lot of you, this person wants to use you in some way. I'm, I'm hearing sex. So for some, this person may be trying to use you for sex. Um, they may be trying to use you for money. In some way, whatever that may be, this person wants to benefit off of you, okay? Let's grab some more here. Okay, so you have teapots. Deep friendship with someone of the same sex. Okay, so you could be getting together, or maybe you have a um, a close friend um, that you can go to, maybe communicate with um, with someone of the same sex. So maybe there's a deep friendship that you have, but that you're a part of. Let's see. Okay, flowers, happiness. Yeah, I feel like you're in a good space. I feel like Capricorn, you're in a good space. And again, I feel like, I don't know why I feel like this person who's watching you and trying to use you, maybe they could be in a miserable space. And I'm hearing misery loves company. So, again, just be careful. Let's grab two more messages from, um, you have hats. You will be playing a different role. And then you also have seahorse. Family matters. So maybe this person could be experiencing... Um, maybe this person could be experiencing some type of hardships or situations with family. Again, they see your happiness. I feel like this person may be trying to play a role interesting so again i'm getting like opportunist okay the fact that this fell under the fair man hat you will be playing a different role for me it's more so like acting so yeah and the fact that this person may be trying to come from a place of wanting to use you okay so again spirit is definitely calling this person out Let's grab a few more messages from the Tea Leaf Oracle deck. Okay, moon changes in your life. Yeah. Interesting. So you've gone through some sort of changes. Yeah, I'm, I'm hearing you've gone through some sort of changes in your life. All right. Positive changes is what I'm picking up. Let's grab some more. Oh, we got hammock. Okay, taking a vacation. Physically or mentally. So some of y'all may be taking a vacation. Again, I feel like some of y'all could be living your best life. And again, this person, they see, they see you as an opportunity. I keep hearing opportunist. So... Yeah, just really be careful of this person and them wanting to come around and enter your life to benefit. So, okay. We have Archway, new opportunities, possibilities, and paths opening up. So, yeah, you do have a lot of new opportunities, and I feel like this person sees it. Period. Okay, new chapter. Maybe you're doing something new. Um, you're starting a new project. 
again, you're living your best life. Some of y'all could be going on vacation, you know. Some of you could be working really hard, working on your career um, when it comes to, you know, this new opportunity. And this person sees it and they want to be a part. It's like they want a piece of the pie. Let's grab one more. What other messages do you have for Capricorn? Okay. All right. We're just going to leave it there. Hmm. Broken rain. Parting of the ways, either romance or business. You have ego triumph over obstacles. I'm sorry. Triumph over troubles, obstacles. Okay. Tortoise. Um, slowly but surely getting ahead. And then you also have heart, great happiness. So, yeah, I feel like a new opportunity. Yeah, things were moving slow, but I, I feel like there's a there's a huge shift. There's a change in your life. Um, for some of you coming out of and having to part ways from a person, okay, maybe even careers. Um, but, again, you are triumphant. Yeah, it's like you are very successful. You've overcome those obstacles, whether it be in romance or career-wise. And you've worked really hard to get to where you are now. And again, I feel like spirit definitely has your back. So whatever this person is doing in the background, you know, trying to watch and see what's going on in your life, it's like I feel like you will be taken care of by spirit it's like they definitely have your back um so that's a good thing but yes this person that's watching you um they're talking about you your name is definitely in their mouth and they want to use you <laughs> we got the five of cups this is my crying over spilled milk somebody is really focused on what is no longer they're emotionally caught up um feeling like caught up in their feelings okay somebody is focused on possibly something from the past so this could be this person's energy um focused on what used to be thank you spirit is what I'm, is what i'm picking up okay Somebody is definitely in their feelings and crying over spilled milk. Nine of Swords is at the bottom of the deck. Really losing sleep. Maybe depression also could be taking over this person's um, energy. I'm hearing uh, there's a mental block here with the Nine of Swords. They could be losing sleep at night as well with the Nine of Swords. Um, having a lot of anxiety as well. Yeah, see, Page of Swords. Somebody is definitely spying in on you. Three of Swords. Okay, definitely. I feel like this could be like a past person. But they're spying. They're watching you. Okay, this could be someone that may have caused you heartache at, a, at one time or another. This could be someone who stabbed you in the back with the Three of Swords energy here. Now they're in a shitload of regrets. But they're definitely spying, stalking, and watching the fuck out of you. Okay? I feel like this is someone who stabbed you in the back with the Three of Swords. Um, this person may have betrayed you in the past. Um, and again, now they're seeing your glow up. They're seeing how happy you are. Um, they're seeing that you, like, moved away, okay? You are moving forward, or you have moved forward. You've definitely overcome some sort of struggle. And this person wants to come forward here with this chariot energy. Like, they want to just come forward, rushing in, okay? For some, maybe this person is for some... They may be taking, they may not be taking no for an answer as well. Um, 
we have the four of pentacles one thing about this person i feel like they are very selfish um they are very possessive they are greedy with this four of pentacles energy as well um i feel like for a lot of you this person is very much so concerned um too much on finances stability money okay with this four of pentacles energy you see how this person is like holding tightly to this coin okay so yeah i feel like this is very much so an indication of this person being very selfish very possessive not wanting to let go okay and like i said very much so concerned with the matters of money okay let's grab some more here this could be um an air sign yeah this person is still holding on to hope um they're still hoping that you know they can come back into your life they're still hoping that they can make this situation right again with you um they are experiencing a tower moment the fact that this situation is over um and they also could be going through a lot of struggles um a lot of conflict and i'm also hearing mental conflict um with this five of wands you know for some of you i feel like they see you as competition um, there could be a little envious and jealousy here as well, especially because this person is trying to, it like, it's like if they get the chance, they will try to trap you, okay? So, um, but I feel like behind that is jealousy and envy because you're moving forward. You know, you've closed out this chapter with the world, you know, and this came to a shock to them because I feel like they may have, felt like you would never move forward okay um but they are experiencing and going through a tower moment and it's like they want to rush into your life it's like this person may have a lot of baggage as well um yeah they see that you're getting attention they see that you are successful you've healed um you're really pouring into yourself um and i feel like this person wants to bring a lot of drama in your life that's the energy that i'm picking up from this okay but yeah secretly i feel like you already know who this person is okay you're very intuitive you know who this person is okay um go with your intuition okay but this person is very much so watching you um to the point where it may come off as an obsession, okay? Very much so. Yeah, it's like they may... This is definitely obsessed energy, okay? Because they're holding on and they do not want to let you go. Yeah, they're holding on and they do not want to let you go. And they are very much so obsessed with you and the fact that you are deciding to move on with your life okay so yeah they could also watch you like a hawk at night as well with the moon energy um being at the bottom of the deck this person could be an air sign libra gemini aquarius um they could be a water sign cancer pisces scorpio we have a little bit of all of the elements here it could be a fire sign as well um, but nonetheless, just keep in mind, you know, that this person, they don't have good intentions, okay? So that's what I have for those of you who this reading resonates with. Um, if this reading resonates with you in any way, like, share, and subscribe. I'll see you next time.